Hi, I'm Mark Taylor, and joining with me today is my colleague Robbie Thorncroft. What I wanted to talk about today is what has happened in the Randwick real estate market over the last month or so, and where do we see the market going, especially having a go to last Tuesday's interest rate increase. Firstly, what have we seen? There has been very strong buyer activity, and this has resulted in very strong prices due to a limited number of properties on the market. So, Robbie, you're seeing the results on the ground, dealing with the buyers on a daily basis. What are you seeing out there? Yeah, Mark, I know we keep harping on about this, but there is a large number of buyers in the market, limited stock. Last week, Mark, we had a one-bedroom apartment in Oberon Street, sell for $400,000. One in Rossgrey, just over $500,000. The Chatham Street, two bedroom semi, $1 million. One in Carrington Road, which only come on, you know, seven days ago, is already under offer around the one two. Another in Coogee would sell for over two million. So who would have guessed that we were paying 500,000 for entry level two bedroom apartment? $1 million for a two bedroom semi. And now we're getting prices of two million plus for a freestanding house. So what we see there is the proof that the demand out there is just exceeding any it is it's unbelievable number yeah. of properties mm -hmm. very impressive so what is going to happen we've got Christmas some seven weeks away which effectively leaves only five weeks for buyers to purchase property and what will be the impact of last Tuesday's interest rate increase Robbie what do you think All right, Mark, what I do know is that there's a lot of confidence in the buyers in the market right now it's limited stock on the market and they are desperate to obtain a property I'm even delivering letters for individuals which have targeted streets of property that they want to buy. Is interest rates going to affect it? Who knows, three, four, five months. Generally, if interest rates go up, buyers drop off. And look, the best time to sell property is when there's no others on the market, which is right now. So if you are considering selling, there has been no better time to sell than now. I'm Mark Taylor. And I'm Robbie Thorncroft. Thank you for joining with us. We look forward to seeing you next time.